good morning students so today again we will do some of the problems based on the chapters 10s and 100s chapter 10 of your ncert book in the previous video i have uh, shown how to do the addition and how to convert from decimal to fraction and from fraction to decimal here we will show you how to do the subtraction and how to change unlike decimals into like decimals that is the first question as you can see the heading okay so let's start so the first question as you can see convert the following pairs of unlike decimal fractions into pairs of like decimal fractions that is the question so here three questions i have taken a b c these are unlike and you have to change to like so already devashi sir in the introduction part has given what are like decimals and what are unlike decimals so let's start so here you can see the first question have taken 3.4 and 8.23 they are unlike why unlike because you see after point here only one digit is there after decimal place and here after decimal place there are two digits now don't get confused don't see that digit here it is 4 here it is 2 3 no problem you have to see the number of digits here after decimal place we have only one digit here after decimal place we have two digits now so these are unlike decimals now we have to change to like now how how you have to change to like just only we have to add one zero now here see after decimal there are two place two digits here after decimal we have one digit so you have to make it two here so how just put one zero that's all so this two becomes like Next one, as you can see, seventy point one, three forty five point one two three. So here again, see here after decimal, how many digits are there? One, two, three, and here after decimal, only one digit is there. So here you have to make three. How? Just put two zeros. Okay. And next one, here it is given four point zero four. and here it is given 4.4 so here after decimal we have two place two digits and here after decimal we have one digit now we have to make it to like decimal fractions so here two and here after decimal one so here you have to make two how just put one zero that's all the only thing is that you have to just put zeros here we have put one zero now it is like here after decimal there are three digits so here after decimal we have only one digit so you have put two zeros here also after decimal we have two here also you have to make two so we have put one zero extra and always remember you have to put the zeros at last you cannot put the zero in the middle at last only you can put the zeros so this is the way how to convert unlike decimal fractions into like decimal fractions okay now let's start as you can see uh, we will start the uh, subtraction now now how to do this subtraction as you can see uh the question is subtract 0.007 from 3.3 the same way as you have done in addition okay the same way as you have done in addition here also you have to do the subtraction but before that you have to convert in case of subtraction you have to convert this one into like that's why at first we have done this how to convert unlike to like because it is required here so let's start what is the question here 
subtract 0 0.007 from 3.3 from means this one you have to write first so let's start so this one I've written 3 one minute 3.3 and here you have to write down 0 0.0 0 0 7 now what you have to do now in case of subtraction remember in case of subtraction you have to make into like here you have to put some zeros to make into like fraction in addition now listen properly in addition if you don't put zeros there is no issue no problem but in case of subtraction, you have to put zero to make into like. Now, why? Now, if you subtract, okay, this this one will come. Now, this one will be considered as ten. That's why, in case of subtraction. So, if you put zeros this one will be considered as 10 now you subtract now you have to subtract now after subtraction what will be the answer one minute uh, now after subtraction what will do here 3 here 9 here 9 2 point so this is the main thing in case of addition it is not required but in the case of subtraction must you have to put zeros now let's see the second one find this 101 kg minus this one so again write down first 101 and here you have to write down 25.125 now see in 101 there is no decimal so you have to make it how 101 point you can write down zero 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 okay this one you have to do it it's not given in the question you have to do it if there is no point give point and give zeros how many zeros you are going to give here after uh, decimal you see how many digits are there one two three so here after decimal you have to give three zeros if there are two digits you have to give two zeros if there are four digits you have to give four zeros now simple subtraction this one will be considered as 10. Now, if you subtract 5, and this one 7, this one 8, your point 5, and here 7. And of course, you have to write down kg. So this is the answer. Okay. So this is the page. Now we have another, another subtraction I will show you. this one subtract rupees 25.25 minus 15.25 so again similarly first write down rupees twenty five point two five and here write down rupees 15.25 subtraction 0 0 point zero one rupees this in fact means only rupees 10 because we know that after decimal, if there are zeros at last, it has no value. That means, suppose you have uh, 
Suppose one example I'm taking 2.300. This is same as 2.3. Because after point, after decimal, if at last there are zeros, this zeros has no value. These zeros we put only to make, only to convert from unlike to unlike, uh, from unlike to like decimals. Okay. So 2.300 equals to 2.3. But uh, another example I want to take, suppose... Uh, if it is given 2.03, now this zero has value. This zero you cannot omit. Okay. Only if the zeros are written at last, you can omit those zeros. So 2.300 means 2.3, but here 2.03. This zero you cannot omit. So here similarly, you see rupees 10.00. After decimal, there are two zeros. You can just omit those zeros. The answer is only rupees 10. So these are addition, uh, addition we have done in the previous video. This one is subtraction and also how to convert unlike decimals to like decimals. Okay, now your homework. Okay, I think, uh, yes, this one I have given as a homework. So you can do. So this is the homework. Okay, so it's clear. So do this homework and send me. And also those who have not written that biography activity number three, just quickly do and submit to me in my personal WhatsApp number. Okay, so today up to this much. Thank you.